125 pounds. So that, on patches, we were seven pounds under what she weighed. That's pretty accurate, that's close. I'm pretty happy. I just want to take a few minutes and talk to you guys now about measuring pigs to figure out their weight. I've had a lot of people tell me, oh, that's not even going to be close, it's not going to be accurate. I've had a lot of people ask me lately, wanting to know about measuring pigs. I made a video on measuring the pigs to figure out their live weight, and I've gotten a lot of questions and a lot of people saying thank you, they've heard about people doing it, but they haven't seen it demonstrated. The other thing I was thinking, I've seen it demonstrated, I've heard people talk about it, but I've never heard results. So I said, you know what? I have the videos. One of the reasons I make the videos is kind of like a journal for me. So I just went back and I looked and I figured out, went to the video, it's called The Final Way In or something like that. I'll link, there's two videos. The first video I'll link, I'll try to link it here. I'll put a card up and then in the description below I'll link the video. It's how to weigh the pigs to figure out live weight. I'll link that video now. And then the second video, I'll go ahead and I'll show the link for is the last one when I'm figuring out how much their live weight is. I think it was three days before they went to the butcher shop. So Patches is the pig that we got back. We went to the butcher. I got the sheet right here. I asked them if they'd get me their live weight and they wrote it down. So our pig Patches weighed 325 pounds. We did the tape measure three days before before she went to the butcher shop and by doing that we figured she, we calculated her weight to be 318 pounds and the butcher said her live weight was 325 pounds so that on patches we were seven pounds under what she weighed that's pretty accurate that's close I'm pretty happy with the results from measuring the pig to figure out the live weight the pig I raised for my father-in-law they said live weight was 281 pounds. I measured her the same day, three days before she went to the butcher shop, and by figuring out the live weight with tape measure, it said she weighed 300 pounds. So 19 pounds different there. Live weight, 281 pounds. Tape measure weight, 300 pounds. 19 pounds different. I was pretty pumped about that. That's awesome. It's not that far off. I could live with that. If it's 19 pounds different that you're going to get by measuring the, t the pig with a tape measure to calculate roughly how much it weighs, that's awesome. Another thing they say is a pig gains two pounds of weight per day. So on my first video, I measured the pigs and figured out their live weight. And then I calculated how many days I had left to get them up to around the 300 mark. And that's how I made the date to butcher the pigs. So we are very happy with the results. They work. So if you're raising pigs and you're trying to figure out when to send them to the butcher shop, measure them. The tape measure weight is pretty accurate. And then figure they're gonna gain two pounds per day of, of weight and calculate what weight you want and how many days it's gonna take them to get that and then make your butcher date. Weigh them before you send them to the butcher. See how close the tape measure weight is to the actual live weight and leave it down in the comments below. I'm kind of curious to see if on different breeds it makes a difference on the tape measure weight. So if you guys have tried weighing your pigs with the tape measure method, let me know what your results have been. If you're attempting to do it, let me know what your results are when you get your pigs back from the butcher shop and you know their live weight versus their tape measure weight. I'm curious to see if the breed of the pig has anything to do with tape measuring or not. The breed of our pig was a large black red Waddle X Berkshire cross pig. So, be interesting to see how it all works out for you guys. Leave it down in the comments below. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it. That really helps us out too. Remember, we're doing weekly video updates. It's usually Saturday nights. They go live around eight o'clock Eastern time. If you want to see more, we got an Instagram account. We're posting a picture a day over there. That's Lumna Acres on Instagram. We have a Facebook page, Lumna Acres also on Facebook. And we'll see you right back here next time at Lumna Acres.